Welcome back to Pack Crackers. It is a Friday, and you know what that means. It means it's special pack opening time. Uh, this week, I'm going to open some shards of Alara. As you may know, there's uh, five three-color, uh, I guess, guilds or realms of Alara. This is from Esper, I think. This little sphinx. Uh, my favorite one out of the three is probably Grixis. It's pretty sweet uh, mana. I also like uh, what's uh, John is pretty nice. If you get some blood, uh, crush the blood braided. It's pretty sweet. So hopefully I'll get one of those. I don't think it's in this deck. I could be wrong, uh, but I do know that in this block, I think it was in the Conflux set. Every Every card was multicolor, so they all had the gold border or whatever border if it was an artifact. And it's not this one, but there's definitely, probably, maybe, it could be, but probably not, some multicolored cards to be found regardless. So I'm going to have the, the Pusphinx uh, look over the proceedings. Uh, I'm going to start it out with a bit of a Yoked Plow Beast. Followed by a Dregscape Zombie. Multicolored card already. And I think that's... Yeah, that is a Grixis card. A Cataract Creeper. Shadow Fiend. Feed. A Tide Hollow Strix. Esper with her Dirty Tricks. With a Tide Hollow Strix. Because it has Death Touch. That's why it's a Dirty Trick. I got a Dispeller's Capsule, Volcanic Submersion, a Relic of Progenitus, a Resounding Wave. If you've been, if you watched the uh, Eternal Masters openings I had, I got one of these. Don't really need it. I got Souls Might. It might not, but who who knows? It might. And my first uncommon is a Filigree Sages. It is a 4-drop, 2-3 artifact creature. I can pay 3, including a blue, to untap target artifact. I got an Algae Garial, 4-drop, 1-1 one, one with Shroud. And whenever another creature is put into a graveyard from play, I can put a plus 1, plus 1 counter on it. Which is nice, because that counts for all other players' creatures as well. I got an Exuberant Fire Stoker, a 3-drop 1-1, one, one. and at the end of my turn, if I control a creature with power 5 or greater, I can have this fellow deal 2 damage to target player, or I can tap to add 1 to my mana pool. Ooh, and my rare is a Broodmate Dragon. Dragon. Uh, it is a 6-drop 4-4 four, four, flying, and whenever it comes into play, I put another 4-4 four, four, Red Dragon Creature token into play. So essentially, I get a two four fours of flying for six mana. So that's not a bad grab. Not a bad grab. I'll take it. Then I got a Plains and a Grixis. Oh, I just talked about Grixis. Uh, card about stuff that they do. So thanks for watching. Me and my broodmate Dragon. I'm going to go ahead and be best mates, as it turns out. Tune in next Friday where I open another pack that isn't Oath of the Gate Watch, Shadows Over in the Shrad, um, Return to Ravnica, or whatever else I'm opening at this time. So thanks for watching. Bye.